how do plants move sugar? I explained in another video how they move water up to the leaves with suction using sun energy, but how do they move sugar? The sun energy allows them to carry out photosynthesis, and sugar is made in the leaves. The rest of the plant needs the sugar. The sugar is pumped into special cells called the phloem. They are in the leaf veins, and the phloem makes a continuous row of living cells all the way through the plant. So sugar is pumped into the phloem. Water is pulled after it. This is called osmosis, and I'm not going to explain osmosis here. Ask your teacher. The cells, the phloem, has a very strong cell wall. And so when the water is pulled in, a high pressure develops. This pressure is more than in the tires of your mountain bike. This pressure pushes a concentrated sugar solution all the way through the plant, down to the roots, into the stem, also up into younger leaves, into potatoes or grains. Well, plants don't like it when you start to mess around with their sugar solution. But sometimes we can get an idea what it's like, for example, maple syrup, which is what happens in this particular tree when you do damage things and you get this thick sugar solution coming out. The way that plants move sugar through the plants is, through themselves is very different to us. We have a heart and we pump blood with sugar around our arteries and our veins. These are outside cells. The phloem is a living cell. So there's a connection of living cells all the way through plants. We're interested in whether they move things as well as sugar, in whether they are moving proteins, complex signals, nucleic acids, so that all the plant's cells in different parts of a plant are really communicating with each other.